What's up everybody, this is Samurai Man, and welcome back to Minecraft Cake Defense 2 by FV Disco. When we last left off, we completed the first five waves, and I explained my strategy and uh, whatever. And now let's move on, we're going to do the next five waves. We are at level three agility. Oh, I better, oh, wow. I better use double gold, that might be a very good idea. Woo, fireworks, okay, next wave. Next wave we have... Uh, zombies, skeletons, creepers. No big deal. This should be easy. I hope. I'm not really sure. <laughs> Alright, Bob, don't let me down. Oh, yeah, of course. Okay. I forgot the zombies are gonna take up one space. Alright. So, possibly more fast forwarding. We'll see. Because there's only so much one can say in a video. So yeah, as I was saying in the previous video, our next strategy is to start upgrading attack and defense so we can do close range combat. Hello Minecraft music, my old friend. What brings you here today? Of this joyous occasion of ruthless mob slaughtering. Yes. You see, the sword will actually get us more uh, gold faster once we actually get to it, because once it's upgraded, it's going to just rip through the mobs. And I mean seriously. I think I'm probably going to upgrade that first. I guess you can upgrade attack or defense first, because you don't really want to fight until you get them to at least a certain level. Possibly resistance one would be important. Oh no! You bastard! Die! Alright. Kill some of these skeletons and creepers over here that are all massed together. Oh god. Don't do that. It is a very rude zombie. Very rude indeed. Oh. Oh! I've got enough! I've got enough for two upgrades! We are well on the roll, guys. This is the strategy. Two upgrades per round is definitely good. Probably the best you can do, really, when you're playing solo. This game is really much more chaotic when there's multiple people. When you're just a solo player. Well, I mean, you can really focus a lot better. Alright, so might as well upgrade, attack. Get us a stone sword. And defense. Now what we do want to prepare for is this wave, wave 8, we need a lot of sword for that because that's when we need to start using the sword. Because magma cubes are ridiculous. So hopefully we can get two upgrades in this next round. Hopefully I don't forget to cast double gold. Trust me, on my off-screen, off off-camera runs, I've made that mistake way too many times. More than I'd like to admit. If you don't cast it, you don't get the double gold. Just makes sense. Alright, as you can see the scoreboard up here actually shows what we're getting. We're getting skeletons and wither skeletons. Lovely. And luckily Bob is unoccupied. Bob the candle. Oh, time to switch corner. The far farthest corner is really not really worth it unless there's absolutely nothing else to shoot. For obvious reasons, I mean you can't really it's harder to hit from a distance, I mean, unless you're like super bowman. Super bow expert. 360 no scope. Yes, indeed. And this game doesn't seem quite as exciting when you're just you know, owning everything, but I think it picks up in the second... Oh no! We didn't get enough! Crap. I should have been focusing more. It picks up in the second half, I think, because the mobs are getting more health, and you gotta switch up your strategy a little bit. Actually, it really picks up with the magma cubes. They get pretty insane. You'll find out exactly what I mean soon enough. Okay, so obviously... Dip a gold. Oh boy, I seem to have a, a 
pesky feline meowing at my door. I have no idea if you can hear that or not. But my cat seems to want my attention. Hmm. This is quite unusual. Probably unprofessional too, but hey, since when is Let's Playing a profession? Ha 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 ha! Ah, yes. Oh yeah, you can see our stats up there. That's cool. One moment, guys. And I'm back. Alright. Kitty problem solved. Oh crap. Double gold. Don't forget that. Never forget that. It's very important. I almost made a very poor mistake. Oh god, it's magma cubes. Oh. Unfortunate. Okay. Well, they're not so bad at first. But trust me, they get much, much worse as they start to increase in number. Once they get to you, you're going to have uh, some major problems on your hands. But for now, they're all right. But this is going to pick up quite rapidly because they're constantly spawning. Spawning and multiplying. Eventually, I'm going to run in and get my, some, some sword action going. But for right now, I think I'm fine with just this. Look at that. Let's say they're sneaking up on me now. You see that? They're trying to play a tricky, play a tricky game. Okay. Now we can start slaughtering these things by the dozen because they're so tiny and pathetic. Just don't let them hit you too many times and you'll be fine. Oh god, oh, my cake. I need cake. It's funny, we're on a giant cake but we're eating cake at the same time. Now see the sword, I've upgraded it a couple times, it's already pretty oh god no 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 don't no, no, fall off. Okay. That was totally unexpected. Alright. Damn, I'm so short. I almost got one twenty five. Well gold is always hundred twenty five, but if you can't get there then oh well. It's okay. We could still make it. Alright, let's keep moving on. Keep this train rolling, guys. What do we want? Zombie pigmen. No big deal. Okay, they are a little bit of a big deal. But not that big of a deal. If that makes any sense. I probably could have really... I could have gotten a lot more out of this magma cubes. I didn't... Really, at some point, once it starts to get big, you want to just rush in and swarm them with your level 2 sword. I wouldn't try it anything lower because, as you saw, the level 2 sword was just tearing them apart. Zombie pigmen, I think a defense upgrade might be in order here. I mean, this is a pretty good sword, but what's next? I haven't, like, fully written out my strategy here. I'm just going based on logic. Diamond strength one. Or gold armor. Oh, they rush you. Let's go with gold. Let's go with defense, guys. Oop. Alright, I hope I do not live to regret this, because I'm hoping that this can be a no-death run. That would be epic, wouldn't it? Totally pro. Like I care. <laughs> I like to be good at games, but I'm definitely no pro at really anything. I guess. Um, well, I wouldn't say that. I'm pretty good at strategy games. I'm a very logical person. Except when I'm recording, because apparently I lose all sense of logic, because, I, you know, that's the same thing for anybody that records gameplay. Alright, so, the zombie pigmen are actually not that big of a deal, as long as you keep your distance naturally. Because they won't actually charge you from a certain distance away for some reason. Like, they're just totally against charging from far away. Like, those far ca the far corner didn't even care. You gotta make sure you watch your flank. You do not want these guys to sneak up on you. I think in the last 10 seconds I might rush these guys to see what else I can get from them. 
Oh yeah, it's worth it just shooting into this clump. Oh man, I might get a third upgrade. Oh, that would be beast. Beast? I don't say beast, what the hell? Oh, what? I never saw the... Oh, you gotta be kidding. Wow. Anyway, yeah, I don't say beast. What's wrong with me? They didn't even have a... It didn't have a 10 second left warning. That's not nice. Man. So close. I would have rushed in. Oh, that probably would have gotten me killed. <laughs> Do not say things that are popular just because you don't... You don't, you don't say them. What am I saying? <laughs> Do not say the popular phrases when it's awkward to you because you don't normally say them. Yes. Oh, sh crap. I shouldn't have bought double gold. Stupid. I could have got... Uh, it's the piggy round. Here's a pro tip. Don't buy double gold on the piggy round. But you know what? I can save it for the next round. It's no big deal at all. Do not cast double gold on the piggy round. That should be the real tip here. So, and attack. Upgrade to my diamond sword of epicosity. And defense. And then we're gonna, we're gonna get two and another 100 gold to get two more upgrades. We're well on our way to victory, guys. Well on our way. Hurrah. $100 piggy bonus round, wave 10. I guess this is a, a wave designed to catch up people that are behind. And look how fast this pig runs around. Well, as long as he dies, I get the gold anyway. Yay, I won $100! Woohoo! Yeah, and the double gold does not double it. Just so you know, guys. That would be like a little bit uh, overpowered, I guess. Alright, agility level 3, power 3, 3, 3, 3. Upgrade. What do we have now? We're going into level 2 mobs. Oh wait! This is the end of the video, isn't it? I'd say that's plenty of time for our second video. Wouldn't you? Yes, I would say so! Who was that? Never mind. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I will see you next time. Good night.